In this video, we're going to talk about the edge node matrix and the redundancy that is built in, how it all works. So stay tuned. The originator of the video partners with the Theta Network to help with streaming video distribution. The end consumer requests the video from YouTube. YouTube communicates with the Theta Network and sees if there is an available edge node in the area where the end consumer is and also checks to see if there is a cached copy of the requested video in the area already and if not it sends a copy to the edge node in the area. Assuming there is an edge node in the area the edge node will serve up the video to the end user or the end consumer. If there is no uh, available edge nodes in the area, then YouTube sends the video directly to the end consumer. The objective of the network is to keep about 30 seconds worth of video ahead on the end consumer's computer. In the event that the edge node is unable to keep up, then YouTube will take over and pick up the slack until the edge node can catch up and uh, continue the process. Essentially, YouTube or the partner and the edge nodes are tag teaming to make sure that the end consumer is served up the streaming video and eliminate any buffering that would otherwise go on. So in this way, the partner and the Theta network are redundant to one another to make sure that the end consumer always has at least 30 seconds or so ahead on their computer and they don't see any kind of a breakdown that could occur with the Theta network. Maybe a edge node goes offline or their internet speed gets clogged up or whatever the reason might be. The provider, that being YouTube, is constantly in contact with the edge node system to make sure that the consumer is getting what they're uh, asking for and the system works well. Keep in mind that when there are multiple edge nodes in an area, they work together to make sure the end consumer is getting the requested video before it reverts back to YouTube to pick up the slack. So that's how the system works. Well, hopefully you now have a better understanding on how the partners and the Theta Network work together to keep the consumer, you know, giving the consumer the best possible viewing experience that they can. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up if you would, and I'll see you in the next video. If you enjoyed this video, please like it, share it, and most importantly, hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching.